See, none of us is really reluctant to kill a plant or two. That's not a hobby that people have trouble jumping into and saying, hey, you know what, let me give it a shot. So I think the kind of interesting thing is why does everything else seem so much more daunting, right? Why do the consequences for failure, for jumping for something else, uh, whether it's you know, whether it's your dream, whether it's a hobby, whether it's an interest, hell, whether it's a person. Why does that all seem so much more consequential? Because when you look at it, most of the time, it isn't. Most things that people do want to try, like what's the worst that can happen? Like you're going to go on stage on an open mic or something, you'll forget all your lines, and then what, three days later, no one will remember that? I mean, shit, no one's going to remember that except you. You probably go to, uh, go to your grave remembering that. 80 years old, on your deathbed being like, damn, I remember when I messed up on that open mic out in Bushwick. I mean, that's shit. Like, we're all our worst critics, right? But you think about it, it's it's a lot like a plant. You screw up at any hobby. You suck at anything that you're giving a shot. And it doesn't actually matter too much. Like, shit, don't bet the farm on it. But the first step... The first step is usually all right. These plants are a perfect example of what I mean when I say that you don't have to be good at something to enjoy it. You can see that they're dying pretty hard. But uh, some of them might do okay. And they look nice. Now, you know, down the road when you have something, you've put a bit of money into it. Now that's more of a measured decision. But this video is more about people that are still looking to take the first step for their interest. And I think you can look at that a lot like picking up a house plant from Home Depot. It's, uh, what's the worst thing that can happen? Most of the time, it's nothing. Your friends, your family are going to find your YouTube channel and they'll be shocked and appalled at how cringe you look like it matters why it really doesn't it really really doesn't look how dead this one is this is crazy i don't give it much of a chance to live i think most of the time we worry more about what people think than uh than how they actually think majority of people are going to be supportive it's more like hey you know shit i wanted to try that i'm glad that you did it man so I think pretty much all the time, we're the ones that judge ourselves the most. But really, give it a shot. 